Welcome back to Franchise TV on this YouTube channel. I'll unbox anything. Today we're unboxing the quarterly All Elite Wrestling Crate. So this is an entirely AEW themed mystery subscription box. It's actually sold by ProWrestlingTees.com. Everybody knows Pro Wrestling Tees already does the Pro Wrestling Crate, which is a monthly box. This is a quarterly box, and it's around, I think, what, 35, 40 bucks, I think, for this box. As always, you get like two t-shirts, an autograph, micro brawler, pen, all kinds of goodies and gadgets and gizmos and awesomeness can be in this box. If you're an AEW fan, this this should be an awesome box for you. If, if you're not an AEW fan, let's say if you're a WWE fan, a New Japan Impact fan, this can still be a fun box for you because pretty much, if you're a wrestling fan, you're a fan of wrestling not just wwe or not just new japan or not just impact you know you're a wrestling fan here we go right on top is the cheat sheet okay so the other side will have all the spoilers we don't want to see that this is called the revolution 2023 crate okay let's see first t-shirt oh it's red i everybody knows i have a rule about red t-shirts i can't wear red because if I wear a red t-shirt, I look like the Kool-Aid man. You can't have that, right? But I see FTR on the front of this t-shirt. This is probably going to be an awesome freaking t-shirt. It just is in the wrong colored shirt. What's it look like? How cool is it? Oh, I like that shirt. Top guys, FTR. Dax and Cash. Pro Wrestling Excellence. That's a cool shirt. I like it, but... You see this? Like, I just don't look good in red. I mean, if, if I come crashing through that wall over there, somebody's going to scream out, hey, Kool-Aid man. Somebody's going to do it. It's going to happen. I like the shirt. It's just on the wrong color t-shirt for me. But I like it. Everybody, if you're a fan of wrestling, you have to like FTR. Fantastic wrestling group. Group tag team. Here we go. We have a sticker. I think I saw the acclaimed on it. Yes, we have the acclaimed Scissor Me. Okay. We have some Scissor Me acclaimed stickers. Let's see. Let's dig in and see if I can find. Oh, we have a, feels like a pair of socks. Yep, we've got some socks. It is. I think it's Orange Cassidy. Come on, the socks should have been orange. That's Orange Cassidy, right? It sure looks like them. Unless if I'm going crazy on it, it should be orange. It looks like Orange Cassidy. And if it is Orange Cassidy, <sighs> Pro Wrestling Tees, you failed. These socks should have been orange. For obvious reasons. He's freshly squeezed, you know? Come on now. Come on. Here, let's do a pin. Oh, looking at me. <laughs> We've got the devil MJF. Probably the hottest wrestler, one of the hottest wrestlers in the world right now in terms of popularity and future potential. You know this guy is going to probably go WWE once his contract's done. WWE's going to throw some big money at MJF. AEW's got money to throw around too, though. They might throw an even bigger contract, but I think I read some, or maybe he said it in, in an interview, it's always been his goal to go to WWE. So he eventually he'll end up in WWE. It's just it's just a given. Here we go. Next time, what is this? We got a luggage tag. Hey, I'm keeping that. We got an AEW luggage tag. Nice. That's mine. I'm keeping that for sure. Here we go. Let's do the other T-shirt now. Then we'll do the other stuff. We got a black T-shirt. Everything is back on track. Everybody knows I love my black color T-shirts. And who do we have? Forged in Combat, Blackpool Combat Club. That's not bad. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I won't keep it. It's okay, though. So, like, this t-shirt, other actually both t-shirts and the socks, will be available in my eBay store. In the description box of this video, there should be a link to my eBay store. There should be one down there. If there's not, I screwed up. But all this will be for sale in my eBay store. Forged in Combat. I'm just not a huge fan of like this big, huge print graphic t-shirts when like, I mean, if it's like some smaller print or something, I don't know. It's just, it's just a big print t-shirt. I don't really usually wear those kinds of shirts when it's just like big words and that's all it, not for me. Here we go. 
micro brawler. And we dropped it. Try it again. Micro brawler. The back says Thunder Rosa. That's a cool one. I think this is her first micro brawler that she's had. I'm pretty sure. I don't think AEW or that uh, Elite Crate does chases on their brawlers that are exclusive to this box. I don't think they do. But that's that's a good one. Th uh, if you're a Thunder Rosa fan, that is a must for your collection. Here we go. Next. Feels like a DVD. Yep, we got a DVD. The back says the best of all elite wrestling at Dark Elevation Volume Number One. All Elite Crate Exclusive. We got some fantastic matches on there. You're seeing big name wrestlers in there. Big time DVD. Must have. Here we go. We have a poster. Let's see what we got here. Oh, I see Chris Jericho and John Moxley on the bottom of it. We got John with the eye patch in that one. This is February 29th, 2020. The main event, sold out show, Revolution. Okay, not, it, yeah, it's a poster. It's a poster. I don't keep usually, I usually don't keep posters like this. I used to several years ago. I keep posters, try to put them on the walls, but my walls are so full of stuff now. I don't have any room left for anything. Pretty much whatever's on, on the walls now, it's like memorabilia, it's autograph stuff. I had some viewers a long time ago make me some custom drawings. You know, that's what's on my walls. Okay, last thing is the autograph, it feels like. Yep. Last thing autograph. Who do you think it's going to be? AEW. Who do I wish it was? Brian Danielson. I'm hoping for a Brian Danielson autograph. Either him. Or let's do a Young Bucks duel. Even though I've met the Young Bucks a few times. I wouldn't mind a Young Bucks duel. But hey, I'm pulling for Brian Danielson. Very doubtful though. Brian's not going to sign for, you know, this kind of a box. It's stuck in there. Why isn't it coming out? Here we go. Oh, I can see through the back. It looks like Jay Lethal. It is. That's a good one. I don't have his autograph, I don't think. That's my first Jay Lethal. I like that. That is a good autograph right there. I'll take that. That's a solid autograph. Here we go. Cheat sheet. Let me show you what everything says. There's the front of it. There's the back of the cheat sheet. Let's just go back through. Verify I got everything. The Excellence FDR t-shirt. Check. Hellraiser t-shirt. Combat Club. Check. Thunder Rosa. They actually did have a chase this time. Well, these don't have chases for the All Elite crate, but Thunder Rosa had 300 chases available. The DVD, check. Jericho versus Moxley poster, check. Jay Lethal autograph. This is probably my favorite item in this box is the Jay Lethal autograph. I'm a huge autograph collector. And whenever I get on an autograph that I don't currently own, because I do have some doubles and triples because I buy a lot of subscription boxes over the past many years. This is my first Jay Lethal. I'm, I'm happy to add them to my collection. The MJF lapel pin, check. Orange Cassidy super kick socks. Why were those not colored orange? You failed. You failed. All Elite Luggage Tag and the Acclaimed Sticker Pack. That is everything that was in the first quarter All Elite Crate Box. I think it was pretty solid for the price point. Both T, or actually the FTR t-shirt was freaking awesome. Just, I can't wear red. Other t-shirt, eh, pass. But autographs, fantastic. This was solid on this YouTube channel. I'll unbox anything, including wrestling subscription boxes.